This is a video on how to search a catalog for a very popular topic among our patrons. Movies. Movie discs and such. Movie discs are DVD versions of videos that we have in the catalog. They all have descriptive tracks which is why they're so popular. So in order to locate all of the DVDs we have in our catalog we need to do a search on the correct term. So this has been a big question from a lot of people and I'm go we're going to answer it right now. Use the term movie disc in the search box either from the main search page or the home page. If you watch now the other thing to look at is 436 results. 436 there are 436 titles in here. That does include one cassette that got in there, but 430 DVDs. So the first thing we want to do is we want to minimize, we want to take out the cassettes to just DVDs. Okay. Next thing you can look at. So we're going to use facets on the left to narrow down our search. If you just want a look at all of the movies available, this is the way to do it. You have 22 pages of results, but this is going to give you from the very first number through the last number. Also, you can narrow down your search by movies that were added within the last three months or the last year, depending on how you choose it. So let's say, for example, I want to look at the most recent movies. So I would then click on the link for within the last three months, and that would just give me a grouping of those. Okay, now the other good facet to look at under the subject facet that we use are the ratings. So if you notice restricted which is R rating, we have PG-13 and we have PG in this list. If there were G-rated movies as well, based upon the ratings that we received, it would also be listed here. So that's good to remember. So if you only want, so let's say you want to get rid of R-rated movies from your searches, then just, you know, you don't want to see an R-rated movie. Use the exclusion, and that will take it out of your list. So here you have your PG-13 and PG-rated DVDs that have been added within the last three months as said here. You can always look at the top under the search results area to see what way you have searched for things. So that's the long and short of how to search for DVDs in our catalog. To, to select one to reserve, there's two ways to do that. You can, for example, Tomorrowland here. You can go in here, click on the link, you can add this item to your book basket. Now, when you do this, it's going to ask you to sign in in order to do that first. So our recommendation is the first thing you want to do before you're actually going to place your reserves is to sign in to your account. So to sign into your account, you go up under this section here that says sign in. You would use your username and password, which in my case we have it. And then you go back to your search results. See they're always available. And reserve. And then you can add this to your book basket. And there it is in your book basket. Now from here you can choose to either do what's called you can either remove it or you can put it along a rush. Now the thing to note about movies in our system is that Movies are a one-to-one -one item. You cannot get more than one movie at a time based upon the demand of the items. So you have to return a movie back before you can get the next one. Keep that in mind when you're placing these things this way. But this will place it onto your list to be able to be checked out. And so that's how you do that. You can also, let's go back to our search results again. You can also, to check them out, you can use the checkbox here under Select check that add selected to book basket that's the button right here it will do the same basic thing okay same basic thing 
if by chance you made a mistake and you want to get rid of it, you can do a remove, or you can clear your entire basket. Let's say you you just want to start over, but the best thing to do probably if you've already added things is just do a remove and that will take it out of your book basket. Then you can go back, use these links, and go back to your search results. Your search results are always available. They stay within the browser. The browser saves them for you until you clear it all out. So if you clear everything out, it's all going to disappear, but your search will always be there until you decide to create a new search. Another thing to remember is you can do another quick search under the refined search area here by putting in new terms and doing more searches. So that's the thing to keep in mind. So that's how you search for movies in our catalog. I hope this is helpful. Thank you.